Sharpton. Good to see you, sir. Hey. How are you, my friend? Good, how are you Good doing? Good to see you. Listen, yeah. big news going on with the Kanye West. What yep. are your thoughts about his comments about slavery and stuff? I think that Kanye is a brilliant musician. I think he needs to not be considered a historian at all. I mean, first of all, anyone that has any understanding of history knows that slavery was not only not a choice, it was the exact opposite of that. People were kidnapped. Are you saying, Kanye, that people voluntarily were shackled and brought across the Atlantic? Half of them, hundreds of thousands of them died in the ocean? Are you saying that with the fugitive slave laws where you were captured, you chose to be captured and brought back into slavery? I mean, it's absurd. It is the height of asininity to suggest people that were lynched if they left the plantation was there by choice. So I think that we should enjoy his music, but we should delete his message. Did, did he make any valid points at all? Or did you, did anything Valid spark point any, about what? I mean, just anything. I was there anything he, that like sparked interest in you? Or like he maybe had an opinion or a good to have a free thinking person is fine. He wants to go with Trump, fine. I don't want to go with Trump. I'm free thinking too. We both had, I defend his right to disagree with me. James Brown was like a father to me. He liked Richard Nixon. But to say that slavery was a choice, to say that Martin Luther King and Malcolm X, right, were too far back to be relatable, when you claim that part of your heroes was James Brown, James Brown was the same era of Martin Luther King and Malcolm X. So I mean, come on, Kanye, let's calm down. We appreciate you as an artist. We respect you if you want to be a free thinker. But we can have different opinions. We can't have different facts. Would you still listen to his music? You know, would you still are you still a fan of his music? Are you, are you still his music has nothing to do with his opinions. And I think that he was a fine musician. I haven't heard his last stuff. I heard he done some pro Donald Trump yeah. stuff. I won't exactly be doing the but boogie do you, on do that. Do you think a, like, a, a lot of people will be, you know, not into him anymore because of his opinions? I think that when you take him. stands, an adamant stands like that, you risk people disagreeing with you and then for not buying from you. I do a three hour radio show every day. 90% of the people called me today said that they're not gonna buy his music anymore. People have the right to do that. I hear you, Mr. Sharpton. If you talk about free thinking, they have the right to think against you too, Kanye. That's true, Mr. Sharp. Thank you so much for your time, sir. I appreciate it.